Wait, so you're out to catch someone? Now I know why you were working so hard to be friendly and outgoing. You're a man on a mission. Mm-hmm. Everybody has something that's missing from their lives, even me. If I can fill that void... Crap. We just fed him his own line. You and I have a lot in common. That happens to be my philosophy in life. When I teach a sixth grade class, I like to bring it up in my graduation speech. It sort of ties into what you said about using Misato as bait. I can tell you regret it, but in my opinion, you shouldn't. There's no difference between a good deed and a bad one. They both have a similar goal, to satisfy a need within a person. Wow, that's extreme. For example, lately I've tried all kinds of things to get closer to someone. Sometimes I'm direct, other times I play coy. At times I've even been deceitful. And boy, it's been fun. With who? A girlfriend? <laughs> I can see how you'd make that connection. Hmm. Either way, it's about filling some kind of emptiness. Um, want a lollipop? Thank you for asking, but I'm afraid you won't find any there. You see, this isn't my car. Where's your car then? In the shop? Whatever your happiest moment is today, another will eventually come along to replace it. And thanks to you, mine just got replaced. Nothing compares to the feeling a person gets when they can finally satisfy their need. You spend all this time searching, and when you get it, it's like heaven. You know, it's true what they say. The more effort something takes, the sweeter the reward is. Where the hell's he going with this? Laxatives. Satoru, you lied to me a few minutes ago. You said you're just pretending there's a kidnapper, but the truth is, you know there's one, and you're trying to catch him. I've resisted the idea for a while now because I couldn't believe it was possible. Well, more like I didn't want to believe. The possibility that someone was anticipating my every move. If you're still worried about Misato, don't be. The only person in that truck is Jun Shiratori's father. I realized something was up with you the day I saw you following Aya Nakanishi. And I was planning to kidnap her the day I gave you and your mom a ride. Looking back, it's kind of funny. I mean, there you were, trying to snatch my prey, and I was the one telling you how to do it. <laughs> that was the second time you ruined my plans. And I started to suspect it was more than a coincidence. I knew Misato's friends were shunning her, so I asked her to the hockey game. Then I told Hiromi about it. If you showed up, my suspicions were correct that you... You were my enemy. No way. When the time was right, I gave Misato a drink laced with that laxative you found. And I bought dinner to place Shiratori at the scene. No. No! Yes, sir, all the pieces fit together, as planned. And in the end, I'm not who you thought I was. Oh, and about the car. I borrowed this one earlier. I was looking for something specific for today. Generic model, generic paint job, a car that's so ubiquitous no one would even miss it. You know, this is the first time I've put that theory into practice. How could I be so stupid? It was so obvious. Thanks to you, Kyle's alive. I just couldn't accept the possibility. Yashiro was on one of Sawada's lists of suspects. But my mom's name was right there, with his. So I figured the list was bullshit and blew it off. I trusted him so much I couldn't even think of him as a suspect, let alone the killer. 
but... He is. And now he's got me right where he wants me. 